now we examine the exercise called reversing around a corner. Here you need to drive around the corner while moving backwards in a reverse gear while staying in your lane. In other words, you do not go into the oncoming traffic lane. Let's start with an initial position. You pass through the intersection and stop at a distance measuring about the length of two cars from it. It should be approximately two feet from the curb on the right side. Before starting the movement, lower the right side mirror slightly downward in order to see better the distance between your car and the curb. The essence of the exercise lies in the fact that the driver must keep a constant distance between the vehicle and the curb. In this case, the car moves along the optimal trajectory and does not end up on the wrong side of the road. It is possible to keep the needed distance by using the side mirror. Since the mirror is directed downward, you will be able to see the knob of the front door. Your task is to keep a constant distance from this knob to the curb. Let us examine this exercise from start to finish. The driver starts to move and continues in a straight line. He looks in the side mirror and turns the steering wheel just enough to avoid changing the distance from the front door to the curb stone. If you do everything right, the car will turn around the corner and still be parallel to the curb. When you see that the steering wheel is already in the straightforward position and the car is moving parallel to the curb, stop. The exercise is complete.